motorcycle racing, which is MotoGP. And believe it or not, it's the first time for me I've been to World Superbike Racing, I've been to the German Superbike Championship, I've even ridden on MotoGP tracks myself, but I've never seen that racing alongside. So, it's time to change that and Sachsenring! We are finally at our seat and we were so clever and we didn't buy grandstand tickets or VIP tickets. We only got general admission because Sachsenring has a lot of open space from which you can see the track really well. The downside of this is you're basically sitting at a slope and it's very easy to slide down. Example. <laughs> anyway, it doesn't bother me because I'm lying here very well. And now it's finally time for some track action. hätten da schon noch ein paar Zehntel gefehlt.
Turns out one of my favorite places here is the Red Bull Racing Circus behind me. They got stunts, they got a wall of death, they got gummy bear juice. So what more do you want? Let's have a look. One thing we should definitely do today is watch Moto2 because we're in Germany and the most promising local hero here is Marcel Schwetter and he qualified in fifth position yesterday. So let's see what he can do in the race. As you've noticed, we've also traded in our bush for an umbrella, which is much, much better. One thing I found out on the internet is that they don't just have merchandise and everything here, they actually have a classic bike exhibition. Now I don't know what to expect from that, or two strokes, four strokes, whatever, but I'll take a look for sure. By the way, we're gonna have more than 30 degrees today, which is why I look like a cobra.
right, we are on our way back home again now and I'd like to give you a little summary of the weekend. Racing-wise, I got three highlights. The first is the podium finish of Jack Miller, which he did after even a long lap penalty, so really, really good job. Second was the fourth place of Marcel Schrotter in Germany in Moto2, obviously. And the third was the Red Bull Rookies Cup. Most people leave after the MotoGP race, but after that, there was a Red Bull Rookies Cup, and that was easily the race with the most and the closest overtakes of the whole weekend. Event-wise, totally fantastic. You should definitely go there. Uh, you got uh, <laughs> 35 degrees of heat. I don't know if that's a recommendation, super, super hot, but you got 232,000 people. That must be a record somewhere. And uh, yeah, fantastic track layout, um, and it's really, really just a joy to be there. I can give you three pieces of advice. Number one, when it's hot like that, bring an umbrella, seriously. Number two, buy general admission tickets, because there's no need to pay extra. You can see all these great places of the track uh, without having to go to the grandstands. And number three is, book your hotel early because otherwise you have to go one hour there, one hour back at least every single day. So, it's a big recommendation, definitely go to Sachsling if you haven't done it before. And with that I say, Johnny Desmo, out. He is super excited. He got up at five morning and continues in next to me, making noise to wake me up. Just go. Oh, Ice cream. Ah, ice cream is good. Maybe today you can try. I don't want to, but you can. And because of salt, we are also sitting under a bush. And because it's so slippery, my girlfriend is sitting with her butt on my shoulder so she cannot slip. And with that, I will finish judging the Sachsenring with the words of Scorpion from Mortal Kombat. Get over here!